Good morning everyone. Today we have our 2005 Cobia 250 for the factory hardtop powered by twin 115 horsepower Yamaha outboards with 280 hours or less. I think it's 250-ish, but I think 280 is a safe bet. Uh, boat's never been bottom painted and rack stored its entire life. Does not come with the trailer that you see in the pictures. That trailer is a brand new one that you could certainly buy if you have that desire or need. But uh, the boat doesn't come with the trailer and it will be priced accordingly. Gel coat shows well. No major gouges or dash it. The stickers are a little scratched, or not scratched, but wearing off. You can replace those pretty easily though. Here are the engines. Counter rotating 115s, very fuel efficient engines. Like SIP fuel. Let me show you this side of the hull real quick and I'll hop up in the boat. No major gouges or issues on this side either. As far as the gel coat, it has a nice shine to it. No oxidation. Let me hop up in the boat and show you what she looks like inside. As we walk into the cabin, we have a nice fishing space, self bailing cockpit. Uh, soft goods were replaced last season, so all of your upholstery in great shape. Live well here, dual batteries and dual battery switches. This transom door closes. This is able to be moved for more access your fishing, your batteries are located in there, aerated live well, raw water wash down, Any, uh, tackle storage, rod storage, you have twin helm seats, another more storage under there, a drainable cooler for fish, standard GPS 190, a Garmin 198 GPS. You're probably going to want to upgrade that, but it does work and it's functional. It has Lenko electric trim tabs. I'll get exact hours 248 hours and 246. Spreader lights on the hard top. Just trying to show you all the upholstery. Little electronics box up there. Inside the cabin, no uh, mildew or mold. There's your anchor locker forward. V berth with the cushion. This middle cushion comes out and is able to be moved. I. Well, it's not a porta potty. It's actually a Jabsco toilet with a flush out, with a you know holding tank and a flush. It's a flushable toilet that uh, goes into a holding tank that is able to be removed and you know without a porta pot. So uh, you can get it sucked out at your gas station or anything like that. It's pretty hands off. Refrigerator. Not sure if that's working or not. We'll have to find out if the owner. Uh, well, we'll test it and find that out. The trim plates around the windows were cracked and the owner never got around to replacing them on both sides. I mean, not the end of the world, but they do need to be there, swapped out. Fresh water system, I believe that also has, yes it does. Wash down, live well. Let me look into the fresh water system. When you call, I'll be able to answer whether or not it has it.
little ventilation windshield right there built-in bow pulpit with a little cushion up front next to the bow uh, the uh, wind Bomar hatch for ventilation hydraulic steering by the way twin engine so that's nice Great little fishing boat with fuel efficient 115s, low hours, engines have been uh, gone through and checked out. Give us a call for more questions on this one. You also have a nice little walk around area for your feet to get up to the bow area while throwing the anchor or uh, getting up there to tie lines and such. Decent space. Boat shows well. It's not. We're gonna get her in the water, take her for a ride, and show you how she runs. Boat also has an AM/FM radio. I just saw that, and the and the speakers in the cockpit. A little bit of wear there, right there on that little. Looks like the dog might have gotten to that or something. <laughs> But uh, just I'm trying to point out the flaws here. Uh, we're going to need a little bit of a cup holder uh, replacement there. We lost the inserts. That's pretty easily done. That's not expensive. But try to point out everything I see. Let's go get her in the water and show you how she runs. Alright guys, that's our 25 Cobia, car with twin 115 four strokes. Don't forget to follow us on our YouTube channel in the bottom right hand corner. You can hit our logo and subscribe to it very easily. Follow us on our Facebook page and if you do those things, you'll get the most up to date listings as they happen and as we post them. Our phone number, 443-324-1368. Thank you for watching and Maryland Boat Sales. Get out on the water. Thanks, guys.